Oh, hey there, hello mornings. Welcome to day 13 of our Peaceful Productivity Series. And today we're talking about President Eisenhower. Why are we talking about President Eisenhower? President Eisenhower was a five-star general and obviously president of the United States. He had a lot of decisions to make. And a simple system he used is now referred to as the Eisenhower matrix or the Eisenhower grid. And it's basically if you picture a box with two lines through it. So there's four quadrants and it's divided into items that are urgent and important, items that are important, but not urgent, items that are urgent, but not important, and items that are not important and not urgent. Okay, let me break it down. The idea here is that we always have a lot of things to do. And it's hard to know what to do first or what to do next or what needs to be done most, especially when we have items that are really important, but they're not urgent. So we want to invest in our children and teach them about character. But it doesn't always feel like an urgent thing, like maybe celebrating their birthday does. There are things that we need to do that are urgent, but maybe they're not really important. And maybe we don't need to be the ones to do them. Maybe we need an uh, outfit dry clean before a concert for one of our kids tomorrow. But maybe we don't need to be the one to do it. It's urgent, but it's not necessarily important for us to do. So if we can look at our task list and divide these into these four quadrants, it can help us make decisions. It can help us feel more peaceful about all the things we need to do because some of them we might not need to do. So let's take, for example, a birthday. Let's say it's your child's birthday or your spouse's birthday or your parent's birthday tomorrow. That is both urgent because there is a deadline. It's happening tomorrow. You can't like celebrate a birthday two days late. And it's important. It's important to you because of relationships. So whatever you need to get done for that birthday is urgent and important. That goes into the priority, the, the number one box, that first box. Now you might also have a big work project due and it is the basis of maybe your potential raise, potential uh, new position at work, but it doesn't need to be done and completed and turned in for another three weeks. So it's important, but it's not urgent. And then let's say that you have something that's in the um, urgent but not important box, like taking something to the dry cleaners. And then there might be something that's not urgent and not important, like maybe organizing your medicine cabinet. So all of these things could be done and maybe should be done at some point in time. But when we think about how we want to organize our time and how we want to organize our day, we want to make sure that we're doing the urgent and important things first that we're also making time and being intentional about doing the things that are important, even if they're not urgent, because those are the things that are going to have the lasting impact on our lives. And those are the ones that often get pushed to the back burner. So by using the system, we can recognize what is urgent and important, what is important, even if it's not urgent, so that we can prioritize those to the top. And then what we can possibly do is we can delegate things that are urgent but not important, and maybe we can delete the things that are not urgent and not important. And that's actually what's often associated with the Eisenhower matrix. Each one of these quadrants is basically divided into do, which is the things that are urgent and important, decide the things that are not urgent but important. So you decide when you're going to do those. I'm going to do those later because they're not urgent. And you decide at a specific date when you want to work on that and then delegate. Those are the things that are urgent, but not important. Can you outsource this to someone else? And then delete. Those are the ones that are not urgent and not important, and maybe they just don't need to be done. Maybe they need to be put into a later folder in your to-do list. So if you're feeling overwhelmed by your task list today, by all the things that you need to do, and you're not sure where to put it, how to prioritize it, try the Eisenhower matrix. Get out a piece of paper, draw four quadrants, list them as urgent and important, important but not urgent, urgent but not important, and not important 
and not urgent. And I'll have a link in the show notes uh, so that you can get more information about that. But once you can divide all your tasks into those boxes, it makes it so much easier to know what you really and truly should work on next so that you're not just prioritizing the urgent things and not getting the important things done as well. All right, I hope that's helpful for you and it helps you live a life of peaceful productivity.